hello everyone welcome to my channel if you want to see how i got this glittery teal eye makeup look then keep watching using my anastasia prism palette i'm grabbing that shade eden and this is our transition shade so i'm placing this all over my crease all over my lid and i am using back and forth motions making sure that's all blended out Next, I'm grabbing that shade Parallel, and with a fluffy brush, I am placing this in my crease using back and forth motions right over top that color Eden that we placed first. Using that same shade, I am placing this on the lower lash line. And next, I'm grabbing the shade Throne. This is a cool teal shade with a like, pearly iridescence. I absolutely love this color. I'm placing this on the inner corner and about half lid. Next, I'm grabbing the shade Osiris and I'm using this Wet n Wild brush, which I absolutely love. And I'm placing that on the outer corner, blending it into the shade Throne. I was looking at myself on the mirror that I have on the side, but I'm grabbing some concealer and I am cleaning up the edges of my eye. Next, I'm using this NYX Glitter Brilliance. I love these NYX glitters and I am placing this all over my lid and I am doing patting motions, just packing on that glitter. I'm packing this on to the other eyelid, how pretty, and this is in the shade teal. Now you do have a lot of fallout, so you wanna make sure you wipe that off with a makeup wipe, and I ran out of makeup wipes. Chisaya, can you get me a baby wipe? Please. Once we wipe off that glitter fallout, I'm grabbing my MAC Fix Plus Spray, and lately I have been spraying this on my face before I apply my foundation, and I just find that it helps my foundation glide on very easily. It helps it blend out just better. I just really, really like doing this. It preps the face. Next, I'm using my Wet n Wild Concealer in the shade Light Ivory, and I'm placing this underneath my eyes. You guys already know the drill, just brightening up that under eye area, forehead, nose, and chin. Using my Wet n Wild Contour Stick, you guys already know this is Where's Walnut. I am doing a little bit of some extreme contouring. I just really, really wanted to get that chiseled out look. Grabbing my MAC Fix Plus, spraying my Beauty Blender, and I'm gonna blend out the concealer first, and then we move on to blending out the cream contour. You wanna use some setting powder, and you wanna place this on all the areas that you placed that cream concealer so we can set. Now while that's setting, baking, I am applying my lashes, and I got some mascara, but if you grab a spoolie, you can just scrape it right off. Next, I'm using my Clinique Pink Pop Blush. These models own Sculpt & Glow highlighters are bomb. They are so pretty. They give off such a pretty glow and the color payoff is just amazing. I place this all over the place. Inner corner, brow bone, lip, forehead, wherever you want to put it. I wanted to go for a neutral lip, so I'm using this Huda Beauty Liquid Lipstick in the shade Bombshell. Once you're all done, you wanna go ahead, set your face. I'm using the Fix Plus again. And that is it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe.